Hello friends, uh, Trilochan here from Silen Software. Uh, now well, we will see how to download and install Spring Toolsuit. So as we know Spring uh, Toolsuit uh, is an environment. So technically uh, we say integrated development environment. So that uh, environment uh, we uh, require for uh, development of uh, spring uh, applications so if i will uh, directly i will go through uh, what uh, the site official site of uh, spring framework so spring uh, dot io slash tools so if i uh, want to get that sts software so guys you remember so this uh, link you have to go through this link that is spring.io slash tools enter and you see this is the official uh, sites of spring and you see uh, this is uh, you see it is uh, what uh, uh, spring tools for eclipse what it have written so for linux operating system for mac operating system and for windows operating system so last time in my uh, video that uh, already uh, I had given the clarity how to download and install STS that was I think 4.16 so now so the latest uh, version is 4.18.0 and uh, so basically I am developing for what I am uh, downloading for Windows operating system so definitely I will choose this 4.18.0 windows x86 underscore 64 now i will click here you see when uh, i clicked a jar file downloaded so it will take some time so this is the way that we will get uh, sts software so nowadays it is very popular integrated development environment tool it is very popular environment widely used for the development of uh, spring applications so now uh, it is downloading so the current uh, version is 4.18.0 okay so it is uh, downloading so very soon it will uh, complete so very simple Sim simply uh, what i did i go through spring.io slash tools so i go through this uh, link and uh, i got this page and here i got uh, sts software simply i downloaded and you see one uh, jar file is uh, downloading now downloading uh, that is going on okay so very soon it will complete yes so now so sts uh, download i completed so you see a jar file downloaded okay so in this way that uh, we downloaded uh, this sts jar file and you see when uh, i will go to that file i will go to my downloads option this file so this is an executable jar file that uh, we got then uh, simply uh, you will double click so already i have done that part so when you will uh, open that jar file okay so you will get this folder sts 4.1.8.0 release so this folder that we will get so again i'm repeating so when uh, we will download sts software basically what we are getting is jar file an executable jar file that we are getting and this file when i will open then this folder that i am getting 
simply just i will open that folder and you see so there is an option spring tool suit option so when i will uh, click so hts environment will open so you see so uh, so i can take it here by drag and drop also then i will uh, click here so now a uh, spring uh, tool suit that hts environment is opening so very simple so now uh, what default workspace option is uh, what uh, uh, that we have this is the default workspace uh, so this option is coming to our picture but uh, we can change it means we can uh, what uh, create a folder in d drive or e drive in that folder that uh, we can what make it as our workspace workspace means whatever we will develop the spring boot application so all applications will what we will keep in one place so let it suppose i will go to a drive and suppose uh, let it i will create a folder new folder suppose i will write uh, spring applications spring applications so i created a folder in a drive so spring applications now i want to uh, keep whatever i will develop the spring boot applications that i will keep in this folder now uh, i will open that hts so hts will open click on browse so i will go to uh, a drive i will go to a drive and uh, so i will go to spring applications so now i will uh, what click on select folder so workspace so according to my uh, what uh, point of view so that is uh, depend upon you so you choose your location where you are comfortable so now i uh, selected uh, there is a folder spring applications in e drive that i set as my workspace then click on launch button so after that uh, when i will uh, click on launch button then uh, spring uh, tool suit environment will open and you see so this is my hts environment and this is the package explorer bar so i can create a new project file new spring starter project okay so uh, you can uh, give the details so here so in my next video that uh, i will show you how to uh, create a spring boot applications or in hts environment how to create a new project so in my next video i will explain i will show you in detail so this video for was that was simply how to get hts how to get hts so i hope everybody got clarity